video tonight from inside Blue Oval City shows more workers dealing with payroll issues in West Tennessee. And now a former employee tells me that the issue is so bad that some can't pay their bills or even maintain their homes that are out of state. This is an issue that I reported on yesterday that workers say is not improving. As construction for Blue Oval City continues, workers say paycheck problems are also in progress. It's not a small problem. Every week is three to four hundred people who checks are short. New videos from the multi-billion dollar mega city shows even more contracted workers for the company, the state group, lining up waiting in orange vest and hard hats to speak to managers about their missing or inaccurate pay. You have iron workers, you have electricians, you have meal rights, you have insulators, pipe fitters. It's it's a whole big project. After WREG talked to workers anonymously Thursday, dozens reached out, including Dante Henderson, who was recently fired. He says he was always vocal about pay discrepancies. I got a whole family. They ain't trying to hear that, <laughs> that these people that I've been going to work for every day ain't paid me. Ain't nobody trying to hear that. We reached out to the state group for answers on when all workers can expect these issues to be resolved. They referred us to yesterday's statement with no clear date or solution. It's a nice project and it shouldn't be tainted with the foolery that they're bringing out there. Now I can tell you that workers say that their next step is to protest to hopefully be heard and have the issue resolved quickly. Hopefully get that worked out.